that prime land, man. Imagine being the coach of a school when you got there. People didn't believe in you. They didn't, they, they doubted you. They thought that your approach was this and that. It's a lot of hoopla. Whatever it is, he can come in. He's not going to win games. You are, Oh, by the way, the only thing you've done is tripled the win total from last year and brought a media storm. The media storm is going to be bad. It's going to be this. It's going to be that. But you end up taking all of that and turning it on its head in your favor and in the school's favor, man. And that's exactly what Coach Prime has done. And we're going to talk about all that in one second, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video, comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all already know, just like the Colorado Buffaloes, we're trying to go to the moon, Alice. And if nobody told you this today, you my brothers, my sisters, my family. I love each and every last one of y'all, man. So check this out. We just gonna get money on the floor. Let's get straight to it. This was posted by Colorado Barstool, man. It just says the amount of exposure CU is getting is absolutely insane. The university ran a report on the equivalent ad value of the media coverage since the since the season started and estimated it to be 90.55 million dollars. That's only after three games. They're going into Eugene this week. If they win that game in, in Eugene this week, it's going to go through the roof. We already know that. It's going to be a tough game, but hey, hey, as long as you go in there, fight hard, do what you're supposed to do. Hey, you, it, nobody can say anything, take anything from you. But these guys right here, you got, look at these, the, the smiles. You got Travis Hunter, Shadur Sanders, Coach Prime, everybody else on the team, like we talked about earlier, Jimmy Horn Jr., all that stuff, man. Just imagine the economic impact, that the economic impact fallout of the community, what they said, they made, what, 18 million uh, or something like that when Nebraska came just in that weekend. And who who knows how much they made this weekend in state. I didn't take a look at that, those numbers yet. But hey, you got people down here, they just they just talking about it. And they're just saying, hey, this is going to be the Mecca of football. Listen, I'm telling y'all in the 90s, everybody loved Colorado football with with all the guys that were there especially Cordell Stewart, Michael Westbrook, Rashawn Salon, all those guys everybody loved it. I don't know if it was because they were on TV the most or what. In the 90s, everybody loved Coach Prime. This is just an amalgamation of or synergistically coming together. Whatever you want to call it, man, these this is just two things coming together, bonding and and it's just going because it's almost a nostalgic effect of of two things that we loved growing up and now we get to love it all over again man except for this time unlike nostalgia it's the product is just as good and only can get better but hey one percent one season of colorado ratings which could net over 100 million viewers would generate more tv ad revenue than most big 10 or sec schools over a 10-year period fox and espn want colorado and prime exclusively under their umbrella you already know that man they fight look they were on fox twice they were on espn the other day hey man they it's if you have spectrum i'm i hate it for you because you can't you didn't get to see them on espn and a hey, it, it's tough man because uh you know i I'm, I'm i'm running that spectrum gambit right now having to help my mama find something else because she wanted to watch Coach Prime this weekend. She's like, I was able to watch him the other two weeks on Fox. Why can't I watch him this week? Because she got Spectrum Internet and they, I mean, not Spectrum Internet, Spectrum Cable, and they don't have uh, the Disney or do they have them back now? I don't know if they got them back now. Maybe they got them back and she doesn't, but she wasn't able to watch it when she wanted to. But hey, my mama ain't no TV head like that. She just wanted to watch us some Coach Prime and she was hot. So I, hey, I gotta help her get that done, man. Hot just like an oven, Ooh. Hey, they're saying, let's sign Coach Prime to this long-term deals. Blessing, pay the man. Give Prime a lifetime contract. Hey, give it all to Coach Prime, man. Hey, and he says, hey, Coach Prime should get a percentage of that, man. Hey, that's what, you know, that's what they saying, man. Listen, I'm telling y'all, man. I'm telling you. The people of Colorado, Rick, jo Rick George, all of those guys, man, it's an awesome thing to see that they believed in the vision, saw the vision, saw where it was going, and you just see where where everything is heading. You still got to go out there. I will say it to the end of time until we stop covering this. You still have to go out there and win football games, but it's going to get a heck of a lot easier to win these football games as you continue to win football games, continue to get the media the media uh, attention, continue to prove yourself and everybody right. And also, like I said, these guys are gonna look at that, look at Colorado and say, I can go to Colorado, I can be myself, I can be on Front Street as long as I'm performing. And they only, they only uh, hey, Coach Prime said, eight, eight or seven, eight dogs away, and I can be one of those dogs. That's what everybody's thinking, man. And I'm telling you, doing numbers like this, it, it, it was no way that they were gonna be 
be in the situation that they were for long. But like we said, not only are the ad are people that are selling ads and stuff watching, the guys that want to play football, they are watching as well. And they are trying to get there so they can promote their brands and do all of that stuff. Like that's just, if you look at that $90 million and 90.55, that's that's free, uh, free ad for your brand, free promotion for your brand or whatever you want to do. And all you got to do is come to work, play football, do what you love to the best of your ability. And hey man, I'm telling you, it's the ultimate recruiting truth. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Like we said, we know that the economic impact is one of the most things that, one of the things that is that is the uh, most important. Like we already know that, that the apparel sales are through the roof. The, the town, the stuff in the town, you know, the, the, the uh, what would you call it? The, the local businesses, their businesses through the roof. Everything is happening right now. Everything is going up in the skies, the limit for the Colorado Buffaloes. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I will holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the people's champ. Guys, speak.